Paul Schroeder is president of the library board. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. Uh, Mr. Mayor, members of the council, we uh, are very happy at this time to be able to present Mrs. Rebecca Sims as nominee for director of Sump Memorial Library. Uh, Mrs. Sims has all the qualifications that the uh, board uh, identified for, uh, for that particular position, uh, which includes uh, a minimum of two years of administrative experience, five years supervisory experience with personnel, and also uh, uh, at least a level uh, uh, of um, Nebraska certificate for librarians. Her level is level five, which is, which is plenty. Um, Mrs. Sims uh, has a master's degree from Kent State University, a uh, master's degree in library science, and, and was director of the Offutt Air Force Base Library for 16 years before it was closed due to uh, budgetary restraints. Um, happy, to pre happy to present Mrs. Sims. I'm Peggy Montgomery and I am a member of the Sump Memorial Board of Trustees. Uh, Mr. Mayor, Mr. Hoynes, Ms. Myers, other council members. On February 3rd this year, the City Council passed and approved Ordinance 1709, which changed Sump Memorial's Board of Trustees from a governing to an advisory board. You can understand that the board thought the transition would be difficult. We worried that our shifting decision-making to the city would not be in the best interest of the library employees and patrons. On February 2nd, Robin Clark resigned as director of the library. The Board of Trustees now needed to search for a replacement director. The five-member board assigned two members, Susan McCallman and me, to oversee that search. The city offered the assistance of Christine Myers, whose selection turned out to be one of the best decisions made during the search. She was knowledgeable, available, and genuinely, genuinely wanted our search to be successful. At our board's direction, we invited members of the community to assist us serving at, on a library director screening committee. Ms. Myers, Ms. McCalman, and I held two extremely productive meetings with John Erickson, Brian Moss, and Becky Crowfoot. They helped us review applications and create a screening grading grid at our first meeting. At the second meeting, we identified candidates who would advance to the interview process. Each candidate was interviewed by two board members and a representative of the city. These representatives were Mayor Black, Mr. Hoynes, and Ms. Myers. The two finalists were interviewed again by different board reps and different city reps. This process had a steep learning curve, but there were positive outcomes. They included bridges were mended between the city and the sump trustees, the city became better educated about how the library functions. Hopefully, we have come to appreciate the board's knowledge, experience, and commitment. Candidates shared knowledge of new technologies, innovative programs, and services that hopefully we can adopt and offer some patrons. The board appreciated the avail availability of city staff to meet with us, answer our questions, and give us confidence that we were acting in compliance with city code. The board owes thanks to the following not previously noted, Richard Miller of the Nebraska Library Commission and Laura Rogers, Ms. Meyer's secretary. We are excited to begin Ms. Sims' tenure. Moving forward, we as a board will work with her and the city to maintain and improve our library. By its location and by the services it provides, Sump Memorial will be viewed as a bright gem in the Monarch City crown. Well, I, my, my, I might I add just a couple things here. As, uh, as Peggy pointed out, we, had a, uh, we went to the community and had a search or a uh, screening committee help to screen 
the applications that did come in. So we, we did every effort we could to include the community in this whole process. And uh, I think in the end that this has proven to be quite, quite a, good, a good thing for us. Um, and I would uh, echo what uh, Peggy said, that we are looking forward to having Mrs. Sims on the staff. And um, uh, we would encourage each and every one of you as council members and as leaders within the city to make yourself known at the library. Uh, I'm, I'm sure that she'll be more than happy to, uh, to welcome you and, and uh, explain what happens in the library. Thank you.